Oh, oh, so look what I got. The new O-ring. Uh, they're not shipping until next... Oh, maybe you couldn't hear me because my hand was over the microphone. But look what I got. The new O-ring. Brand spanking new. Even though they're not shipping until next year, I've managed to get one. So um, I am going to talk about it because I literally just got given it. And uh, I'm in a little booth here at Slush. Like, it's literally tiny. Um, so I'm going to go through the ring go through the app, show my initial thoughts, first reactions, and uh, answer any questions that you might have. Sorry for the setup. I've literally just got this, ran over, found the booth, and um, we're going to go through this ring. So uh, give me a minute here while I set up my laptop. And I'm in this like really uh, tiny, like it's half a meter by half a meter square booth, but it's soundproof. Which is really cool. So yeah, again, oh shit, I just dropped it. Sorry, my, my language, hopefully there's no kids watching. I have the new ring, the new Aura ring, just announced like an hour ago, less than. And I've got one of the developer's phones and uh, I've got the new app as well. And again, this stuff is um not released yet. It was literally just announced. Um, so give me a minute, grab a coffee. Write down all your questions because I'm going to be going through everything in 30 seconds. Sorry for the shaky camera. Okay, just, just give me a minute. Write down any questions you have about this new ring. I haven't even looked at it properly myself and I haven't looked at the app. Um, I just need to set up my, my computer here. So write down your questions, give me 30 seconds and uh, we'll get into this. And hopefully you can hear me. If you if you can hear me, just give me a thumbs up or say yep, you can hear me. Because I'm on my phone here. <sighs> All right. Bring them on the camera. All right. All right. All right. Uh, we're coming. Coming up. Write down any questions you want. All right, good to hear the sounds coming through. Okay, last thing, I'm just putting this up to, or I do have a, a sneak peek article that I'm updating right now. Um, so if anyone wants to, I'm just gonna change this again. If anyone uh, wants to have a read on my new article, uh, I'm gonna post that in the comment section. All right, so that's going up now. Okay, okay, okay. Questions. All right, what do we got? All fine, sound. Hey, you're just fine. Awesome. All right. So, if you didn't know, um, the Aura Ring, Aura Ring, which I've been using for two years now. Everyone's looking at me weird. I don't know why. I'll just show you guys what where I am. See this? We're at Slush. It's a really neat, uh, really neat vi um, conference, but it's so noisy, and uh, there's these little private uh, rooms which I'm in but they're all glass, so everyone's looking at me weird. All right, so, um, yeah, for those of you who have no idea what the Aura Ring is, this is the Aura Ring. It's a big unit. It's been around for two years. Amazing device for tracking sleep, recovery, heart rate variability, respiration rate, temperature. Um, for those of you who, who know all about Aura Rings, you know, I'm, I'm not going to repeat myself here. But today, <clears throat> an hour ago, the CEO of Aura, Finland, uh, Cumley based in Finland, released or announced the new Aura Rings, three of them, okay? And this is one of them. I'm told this is the balance design. So I'm gonna get some photos and uh, publish everything very soon. Um, three designs, I got Balance, Heritage, and Balance Diamond. Balance Diamond literally has diamonds in it, all right? It's very expensive. Um, the price tag's like $1,000, okay? Um, there's no functionality differences between them. It's just design, okay? So knowing that, let's take a look. Yeah. Uh, original, new one. See the size difference? It's insane. It's bloody insane. It's ridiculous. Even the band, for those of you at home who have an Aura Ring and want to compare it, the band on the original Aura Ring is thicker than the band on the new one. Like, that's how small it is. 
It's it's very tiny. So for those of you who have always been put off by the big size, the big bulky size, uh, which is fair enough, and it took me a while to adjust uh, adjust to it. This new one, it's it's no different to a wedding band. Like seriously, it's so thin. So that's the first big thing. All right. Uh, I'm just checking the notes coming in. Fire through any questions if you have any, all right? Um, what else? This is quite heavy. The original O-ring, quite heavy. This new one, it, it's so light. Like, it's ridiculously light. I thought this was plastic. When the guy gave it to me, he was like, oh, here we go. And I said, oh, is this a demo one? And he said, no, it's, it's the real one. It's made of titanium. T titanium. There's a tongue twister for you. I've never actually used uh, a titanium ring before. Um, so I didn't realize how light they are. Like, it is so light. Uh you think you'd break it it's that light right which is again amazing because this is quite bulky and heavy um but it's titanium so it's super super strong i don't know what the deal is with like scratchability and everything like that because um i haven't used it yet <laughs> and like i've only got this about two minutes ago but uh knowing that i've had this one for two years and i thrash it in the gym um and there's not one scratch on it I'm gonna assume the new one's just as good. However, old one is ceramic, new one is uh, um, titanium, like I said. Sorry, there's questions coming through. I'm trying to get them all here. Uh, all right, any terms of performance? Uh, old one, new one. Yeah, huge, huge difference in performance. I'm gonna go through that soon. Firstly, I wanna look at the design, all right? So, one of the reasons why it's so thin is the battery is in the whole band now. So they've developed uh, curved batteries, which enable them to put the battery in the whole ring. This one, the battery's at the top, which is why it's so bulky, okay? So you've got the whole battery around uh, the band and then um, the chips built in as well, which is why it's so small. I mean, it's, it's tiny, right? It's insane, it's incredible. Battery life is a week. That's saying you'll get a full week out of this now. Battery life on this one was two to three days uh, I personally charge it every day so we're up to a week now which is nuts I mean yeah look how small it is um, what else do we need to know on the design front three designs like I said the balance one it's kind of hard to see here but you can see that slight little race uh, let me see if I can do this let's get a little so this is so like unprofessional I'm sorry guys but ooh, 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 where are we See that little raise there? I'll try and do that because there's light coming down. There's a little lip on the top, all right? So that's the balance one. The Heritage one has a flatter top, a flatter base. Uh, I don't have that with me, unfortunately. Uh, maybe I'll try to get that for a, another video, a, a proper video where I don't rush all this on the last minute. Um, so that's balance. The balance diamond has a ridge of diamonds, or has a line of diamonds on that ridge, okay? Um, three or four colors. What were the colors? We had... Uh, Rose, yeah, a rose color, uh, a black, a silver, and a stealth. So for those of you who had the original stealth, it's the same sort of pattern. Um, yeah, silver, rose, rose. Yep, yep, I'm just checking all this. Uh, questions, any chance of shipping before April 2018? They said quarter two. Um, I'm going to go pick their la brains later, but they're swamped at the stand. Like, it's ridiculous over there. So I, I don't know if I'm going to get many answers for the next hour or two at least. Uh, performance. All right, so performance differences. Huge differences. All right, let's go through them. And again, I put, put a link to the, an article which I'll publish based on the, sta uh, the data I know or the differences I know so far. So the first difference, size and shape, less than half. Uh, battery, improved battery life. Wireless charging, all right? This has wireless charging in it. This one requires a dock you sit it in the dock the dock's quite bulky you know i'm traveling with it it's you know it's another thing you got to take right um this one wireless charging i don't know how that's going to work i've never used wireless charging devices before but i'm told you literally just set it on this little pad and it will charge okay really cool um i don't know how big that little pad is but i'm assuming you know it's going to be better than a dock all right so that's good what else have we got in here uh sensors i'm not too sure what sensors are improved except for the body temperature. The, I know that the body temperature is extremely af uh, accurate now. Um, they're tracking down to 0 0.05 centigrade preci precision. All right, so extremely accurate uh, body temperature. I don't know about the other sensors. Um, it's been two, three years since the other one was made, so I'm assuming there are improvements. CPU processing power uh, has been boosted by tenfold. All right, so 10, 10 times faster. And again, um, I know that it's not a computer in the, in the sense where you're like writing emails on this or playing games. 
but you know more processing power better battery life processing more data um using all the sensors right so all these things are good uh what else have we got in here um yeah so that, that's all i know at the moment in regards to performance uh sensor battery life um processing power okay what else have we got uh any other questions coming in no. so yeah I, i'm gonna get to that very soon but my first impression is it's so light it's so thin it's so small i'm so used to this bulky ring and now we've got this tiny little band it looks like a witty man it looks really nice like it looks really really nice you know uh i don't want to put on my finger in case i can, can't get it off and it'll be right i mean you 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 if you know with this ring here you know people always look at it it's quite bulky right this one just looks like a, a witty man so I think a lot of people are going to like that, you know, especially females who, who didn't want the, the bulky rings. I think that's going to be a, a, a big attraction for a lot of people. And again, I've only got the silver uh, balance. I haven't had a look at the other ones. Um, what else can I say before I get into that? Any other questions about the design, about the actual device itself before I look at the app? Just type them in the box. Uh, I think instead of an engagement ring, it's so funny you say that, Phil, because we're getting married, uh, we're, uh, I'm getting married next year, and um, I, that was what I thought, and Rebecca's been asking me, oh, so I need a wedding band, I'm like, this will do, I mean, it looks nice, and Jordan Lamb, uh, is it different? Yeah, I mean, I've, I've just explained all that, um, you're, so, and I've also posted uh, a note uh, a link in the comment section. So there's all these questions coming through in the comment section where I explain all the differences. But yeah, I mean, look how different it is from a physical point of view. Um, it's way different and improved battery, improved processor, and everything. Uh, see all three models. Yeah, I want to do that, but the the booth here was just like it was packed. Okay, so I couldn't. You know, I just got this and I ran with it because uh, I wanted to get something up. But the balance and the, there's two real designs all right balance and the heritage they're both very very similar okay like very similar if you look at the images all that's different is the top this one from a distance you probably wouldn't see the little peak on the top uh like it's so hard to see the peaks just there but um up close you can notice it the diamond one is obviously going to be quite apparent because there's a line of diamonds going through and then the um the heritage is flat around there okay what else we got uh but yeah i'll uh, i'll try and get um all three i don't know a photo or a video increase in the emf i have no idea they, they said bluetooth smart where i know the other one was i know that the other bluetooth was really strong like you could sync it on the other side of your room and i was always like why is it so smart uh so powerful you don't need it that powerful so i'm hoping they take they're taking that feedback on uh, on board and and decreased it but um you can it's still got the airplane mode right so you can turn turn it on to airplane mode uh sorry these guys are looking at me again um you can turn on airplane mode and turn off EMF and all that, okay? Uh, price on the normal one. Yep, okay, so the prices I got were, this is what I got from them. Sorry, I gotta pull it up, because this is also new, like this is just, just happened. Uh, all right, price, 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 price. Where is it, where is it? I've got all the data here. All right, the balance silver, the balance black, the Heritage Silver and the Heritage back Black are the base models. They'll be $299 US when they ship, okay? Uh, the Balance Rose and the Heritage Rose and the Stealth, so the, the more premium colors, $399. Balance Diamond, $1,999, okay? Um, there's a pre-order special. I have been given a code because obviously um, I'm obsessed with these things and, and I do a lot of writing with Aura Ring and I am affiliated with them. Um, so I've been given a code. I get a cutback on that. You don't have to use that code, but if you do, you save a hundred bucks off it. It's simply my last name, Fergus, F-E-R-G-U-S. Um, but I'm I'm hearing because again, this has all just happened. I'm hearing that current ring owners um, have been sent an email or something saying that they can use a code and they that it's a pretty good discount as well. I don't know all the details. So if if you are a ring owner, uh, maybe before you use my code, just check your emails in case there's a better offer out there. Um, or you know, a way you can upgrade or something, and um, 
yeah, look around, shop around. But yeah, my code Fergus F E R G U S save a hundred dollars. So the base model is one ninety nine, the the premium model is two ninety nine, and the diamond model is eight ninety nine. Like you know, it's a big ticket one. Um, that is until the end of the year. So you got one month, and then what are they? I got two codes, and if people use them, I get one free. Well, there we go. You should uh, you should get on your own Facebook Live, Jordan, and, and start sharing them. Seriously, um, that's a pretty good deal. 50% off. So I'm assuming you already have one, Jordan. 50, yeah, that's a really good deal. So yeah, I mean, again, if you've got a ring, check your emails because I'm hearing this from a few people now saying they got offered um, really good rates because they were existing customer. And I think that's really good from from Aura's point of view. You know, you're rewarding, you know, you're looking after your customers, right? So um, unfortunately for, for new customers, you're probably not going to get the, the same big deal. Um, but... Yeah, shop around, look around. There's all sorts of specials going on given the launch. I know they've got a special here. It's slush 17, but that's 30% off the base model. I think mine works out to be about 33% off. So there we go. Um, no worries, no worries. Yeah, Phil and Jordan reach out to each other. Uh, all right, so the app. Now, any other questions before I get into the app? I really need some water. If you've got any questions before I get into that, please fire them through. Otherwise, we're going to play around. And this is my first look, okay? Like, I've got it sitting here. I haven't even clicked any buttons. Uh, all right, I'm going into that. There's no questions coming through. Let's do it. So, this is the app. Hold up. I'm going to change my camera so um, I can talk and play with the app at the same time. Let me see if I can do this. Let's just put some uh, interchange music on. And this is coming live from um, Finland, Helsinki, at the Slush Conference, where I'm currently jet lag and running off caffeine and God knows what else. Sugar. All right, sorry guys. This is this is nearly there. Okay, can everyone see the the app? Can you still hear me? Okay, I'm just gonna go. All right, so this is the app. This is one of the, the staff's phones. Uh, so it's got his data on it. It is only the beta testing uh, one, I, I, it's not final. I don't know when this app's going live. Uh, I think it's gonna come out before they release the new ring, which is here, here for the newcomers. Um, so anyway, this is the main screen. So the obvious difference is the white background, all right? So the, the original app is um black background so that that's interesting uh what do we got down here we've got an add note function so i'll play around with that we've got the the same overviews at the top here i'm just going to get a pen so my finger's not going through the box hi steven if you have any questions fire them through uh, lose my voice all right here we go pencil is that camera angle all right Okay, so what do we got here? We've still got the um, overview button, uh, overview screens at the top. I wish I could do a side by side with my app, but I'm using my camera. Um, sleep, readiness, activity. Uh, there's, there's also a graph in the background there. So that's, that's kind of cool, but it's hard to see. And again, this isn't the final, uh, this isn't the final version yet. So who knows um, what's going to change before it comes out. All right, so it's got the activity data in here, which the original one has. Sleep score, which the original one has. So it's, it's a similar sort of setup. Um, readiness. So all that looks pretty similar. Uh, but again, the interface has changed. I, I'm assuming I'm allowed playing around with this. I didn't, I just asked him if I could film it and he said, yeah, but maybe I should have checked with the HR or marketing team. So uh, anyway, I might get in trouble for this, but we'll see. So let's click on sleep. All right, so we've got, it's totally different graphs. And again, this was the first time he, that I've seen this. So you got a really good sleep the other night, not nearly 10 hours, wow. Um, I'm trying to scroll, but it doesn't scroll, which the other one does, so that's interesting. Instead, it goes to a different screen. All right, so we've got overview on DDoS. Let's say on overview for now. So we've got the same sleep contributors. Yeah, it's all pretty, pretty standard stuff, so you can click it. So it's all very similar. Um, and then details, sleep phases, rest and heart rate, bedtime start and sleep score. Well, that's different. 
that's a pretty neat graph. So that's sleep score based on bedtime start. Oh, that's really cool. So you can see for this gentleman, his sleep scores, you know, his sleep scores are all really good, but uh, when he went to bed at 11 o'clock, he didn't get a very good score. So I'm guessing as you get more and more data in here, this is gonna show some really cool stuff. Like if you start seeing your sweet spots always around 9.30 for instance, you know, like stuff like that. Really, really cool. Um, what have we, how do I change date? Oh, okay, oh yeah. All right, and again, sorry, this isn't very professional. It's just me playing around with this for the first time. So I'm scrolling dates and you can see where it's changing, uh, change all the data. If you got questions or if you want me to go back to a screen, just let me know because I'm just sort of playing around. To be honest, because uh, this is my first look at it, initial thoughts, um, it is kind of hard to differentiate between the color codes here. Like I know on the other one it was like purple, gray, and another color, pink. Whereas this one, it's kind of all the similar shades. Like it is a little bit, it is a little bit uh, difficult. To see and again this see what I mean they're all very similar similar there. Uh, and again this is still the better version so I don't know what will happen he doesn't get much deep sleep does he so this is your overall graph up here oh I feel like the uh, jet lag just hit me because I just got really tired really fast um let me know if you've got questions guys because I'm just sort of playing around here uh, so that, that was sleep let's go into readiness so we've got readiness score at the top there, HRV, body temperature, respiration rate. So that was all, that's all on the other app. Oh, actually, I don't think the respiration rate, rate's on the uh, other app. You have to go on the cloud to get that. Uh, and then we've got all the stuff down here. So you're getting feedback here as well, which is good. Like rather than just a number, you're getting uh, words. And I know that seems silly, but sometimes you get a number and you're like, well, what does that mean? So optimal, optimal, you know, pay attention. That's good. That's good. I like that. Uh, rest. So we've got the... We got the, I'm just gonna disable that. Oh, shit, I haven't used this version. Okay, there we go, do not disturb on. Um, so now we've got HRV nighttime, which is really cool, rest in heart rate, restful periods. All right, so I mean, pretty similar. No, nothing too, it, it's more of an interface change by the looks of it. Uh, a few little new features in there, um, which I'm sure they're still working on, but the interface has changed a lot. So activity, Oh, go away. Uh, again, I like these. I like these pay attention things. You know, I think that's that's really powerful. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. Activity intensity over time. Yeah. Uh, so it's just it's going to take a while to get used to the new apps, uh, the new graphs, and the new colors and everything. I'm sure, like someone who, who gets this ring for the first time. You know, it'll be perfect. It makes go away. It makes perfect sense. Okay. Uh, what else do we have? So yeah, we got this add note function, which I don't know what it is. Um, what have you been up to? Ah, oh, so they mentioned something about tagging and, and notes. So this must be it. So I'm hoping if you can tag things, you know, you go to bed and you tag today I had alcohol and I was traveling, which is what I did last night. And then over time. I'm hoping that there will be a correlation function where it will show, you know, every time you have alcohol, your deep sleep is down 70% or something like that. I'm hoping that's what they do. I'm hoping, hoping, hoping. I've been waiting for a feature like that for two years, literally. If you read my first review on my website, alexfergus.com, um, you'll see me mentioning that over and over again. So I'm hoping with that tag function, they'll do it. Uh, I'm hoping to get an, I'm hoping, there's so much hope going on at the moment. I'm hoping to get an interview with the guys, one of the developers or something this weekend, um, where I can ask all these questions. And again, that blog article that I've posted in the comment section at alexfergus.com, the new aura ring, everything you need to know about the new aura ring, I'm going to be updating that when I get more information, okay? So I, I recommend you go there and subscribe to the email list and every time I get like a big you know, piece of information, I'm going to let you guys know. So if you're sort of on the fence or you're unsure whether to get it or you just want to get all the latest news, make sure you sign up over there. Um, any questions, send them through. So what else we got up here? We've got the top settings. All right, so that's all kind of just your standard stuff. So, all right, that's the app. I mean, what's down here? Okay, I don't know what this is. I don't know what all those colors mean. 
Maybe that means when you got a high score, perhaps, or a low score. Yeah, that's what it must be. So see here, it's got a tick. Let's see if that changes. So yeah, it must be what, above 90? 90, not 88. It's the lowest one. 95. So it must be like above 85 or something, you must get a tick. And then down here, you can see all the times you got really good scores. So that's good. Like maybe you'll start seeing Monday to, on um, let's say Tuesday to, Tuesday to Wednesday, you're always getting good like sleep scores or something. And you might be like, all right, well Monday, you know, if, Whatever's happening Monday to Wednesday, I need to do more of to get better sleep. So again, um, I like these new features. It, the, the thing with the Aura Ring, it's amazing at reporting. Like it gets so much data, it's accurate data, it's reliable, and you get so much from it, right? The downside with it was interpreting that data. Now in two years, it has come so far because the first app, which I had a long time ago, was, you know, it's kind of like, oh, there's all this data, but you can't really tap into it. The graphs got better, the, um, the what else got like the grass grass got better the interpretations the recommendations you got were better and better more in depth more detailed the cloud dash that went up that was amazing as well you know like more and more data but you still needed to sit down and really like process it yourself to, to figure out what was going on so i'm hoping with this new app there's going to be more like correlations and and stuff and by the looks of it there is like even this here it's going to make it easier again let's assume yeah, this color, the purple is the, the sleep. So we can be like, all right, you, you'll start noticing patterns. Um, you know, he had a really good block here. So you could, I have no idea what he was doing in that time, but maybe, you know, he was at home and had the week off and you'd be like, all right, well, I need to, there's a correlation between working hard and bad sleep. I mean, you look at this way. I know he was traveling right at the moment. So his activity has been really high, but his readiness and his uh, sleep have really dropped off. Uh, I know he traveled, he left around same time I did, like it was like the Monday or the Tuesday. So um, yeah, and that's exactly the same as my data. Activity's high because you walk in airports and all that fun stuff. Sleep and readiness is just blowing out of the water. So again, it's really nice having this overview. Um, I'm starting to like this screen more and more now that I play around with it and think about it. And then what have we got down here? Oh, trends, wow. Oh, all right. This is cool. And again, remember for those of you who have just joined on, uh, this is, one of the Aura Ring developers' phones. Uh, it's a better testing um, version. Uh, it's not the final one. And I'm playing around with it for the very first time, so I, I'm just figured I'd might as well record it. So anyway, so I've gone from the main menu down into the trends here. What have we got? Sleep, readiness. Oh man, this is cool. I was thinking like, felt like there wasn't that much change, but this is, this is a huge feature. All right, so let's go deep sleep. Actually, no, that was a bad one because he doesn't get much deep sleep. Let's go sleep score. Okay, so this is similar to the web dash for those of you who are Aura Ring user. By the way, if you've just joined on, came on, here's the original, here's the new one. See the size difference? Crazy, huh? I'll just leave that there. Um, Alright, so yeah, sleep score. Daily, we'll change that to like weekly, monthly. All right, well, that's cool. It's cool, good being able to get that overview. The graph looks a little compressed, but maybe I need to rotate it around. Um, if the ring, will, I'm just reading the questions coming through. HR signal so we can connect it to a watch. All right, I am told, and don't quote me on this, I might be wrong, but I am told that, yeah, sorry for the late comments here, I'll just put the new one back on. Uh, I am told that there is a way to get real-time data from it. All right, I'm told. And again, this is also new, like an hour and a half now. Um, but I'm told there's a daytime tracking feature where you can go in and you can track your heart rate and, and do all that. So like if you're meditating or doing yoga or something, you can pull it all up and be like, all right, well, what's happening? You know, like what's my heart rate doing? And hopefully you can see things like temperature and, and um, I don't know, respiration rate and all that other stuff. And I'm gonna do a bit of a shameless plug here. For those of you who want to pre-order it, use code Fergus, my last name, and you save 100 bucks. Okay, but if you are a current Ring user, you might not want to use that because apparently you've been sent an email with either with a really good discount. All right, and I need to check my emails. But if you're a new Aura Ring user, this code lasts until the end of the month, and you get 100 bucks off. And this is the uh, balance. 
base model. So nice, huh? It's so light. I can't believe how light it is. I should have done this shot at the start. I'll go back to that soon. So they got uh, batteries in the band now, which is curved batteries, which is why it's so thin. Um, balance model has a slight little peak at the top there. The Heritage has a flatter top. The Balance Diamond has a line of diamonds through the middle there. Alright, let's go back to that. If there's any questions, let me know. So yeah, this is the Trans, which is really cool. So we've got Trans for all the data. Yeah, this is this is a cool function. It'd be, I, I hope you can overlay data. I hope you when the app comes out, you can say, alright, I want to log body temperature and deep sleep. And then have both data points on the graph. That would be really cool. Um, go away. And then activity as well. Alright, I'm pretty exhausted. I'm, I'm losing my voice. Uh, hopefully that was that showed you a bit of insight into the new app and the new ring. Um, be sure to head over to alexvings.com and check out the blog because that's got all the facts over there. Uh, and sign up because that's where I'll be posting you know, these videos, more videos when I get them. I'm um, hoping to get an interview on with the team and um, and just leave this here in case anyone just signs up. Now, uh, I hope that I will get. I don't know what I'm saying now. I'm so tired. Um, yeah. Someone tell me what I say. Oh, sign up to the blog. Sign up on my email list and. Um, I'll send out updates whenever I get them. Like, I really want to try and get an interview with the guys and, and pick their brain. I've got a list of questions. If there's something you want me to ask them, send them through to me, put them in the comment box below, and um, I'll make sure I, I ask them that. If I can get the interview with them, I'm sure I will be able to though. Um, so yeah, any questions about the ring, about the app, um, you know, whatever. Shipping, second quarter 2018. Pre-orders open now, like literally right now, um, and you can use code Fergus if you are US, save 100 bucks, and that lasts until the end of the month, and then they stop. It is a really nice ring. It is so light. I can't believe how light it is. Like, you can just hear it. Hear the weight of that versus that one. It's it's insane. Like, I, I for those of you who weren't here at the start. I thought it was plastic at first, and then they said, no, it's titanium. I've never actually used a titanium ring before, um, but they're so light. It's incredible, and it's meant to be really strong as well. It will be interesting to see if it scratches, because, yeah, this one I've had for two years has <laughs> no scratches on it, so it will be interesting to see. I don't know how, if this user um, uses the gym much. I know he does a lot of running, but it looks pretty good condition. Alright guys, I'm going to get some food and water and just sort of switch off for a little bit. Um, before I go, if there's any questions, let me know. Otherwise, just post a comment later. I think this automatically gets saved to Facebook, so... Oh, I am tired. So it's Alex Fergus from alexfergus.com talking to you with... Uh, here live at Slush in Helsinki, Finland. And coming to you two hours or less than that now um, after the new aura got announced. And there's still a few people listening. If there's any other questions, let me know really quick. Otherwise, I'm going. I'm going to go. Okay. I'm going. Bye. Thanks all for stopping in. How do I end this? Um.